short video today. We don't have too many really short ones, but this is going to be a real short one. And this is a technical tip for all GL owners, especially the cab uh, version of the GL tractor, uh, specifically the 40 series, and it may apply to other series cab tractors as well. Um, I've been having a very annoying squeak in there, just like, oh, well, just like it was a mouse in the cab, and it was, sometimes, sometimes you'd even hear it on the videos, and it was, it was really annoying, almost as annoying as this, is when the mother-in-law comes to visit. That's how bad it is, guys. So anyway, I uh, decided today, no matter what it took, I was going to find a problem. Now, the thing is, is this tractor has been heavily modded. It's, uh, the OEM seat was removed. The pan of the uh, seat area, where the uh, floor portion of the seat uh, was modified to fit a Grammar Air Ride seat. So I assumed it was in the seat. So I went and investigated the seat itself and no, the seat was not the issue. And uh, although when you grab the seat, you would get the squeak. But when you would step off the, uh, the little step going up into the cab, the squeak would stop. So I said, well, holy smokes, what is this? So now I'm going to take you over to the tractor and I'm going to show you exactly what caused the problem. It's literally a two minute fix and uh, it's one that will probably save you from going out of your mind. So let's head on over. Okay, let's have a look-see. Okay, as you can see, this is the Grammar Air Ride seat, which I suspect it was the problem. And you could move this and you'd get a wicked, wicked squeak coming from the seat area. The tur it turns out the problem was in the uh, draft control for the three-point hitch. And what's going on is when these are assembled in the factory, uh, especially with the cab models, there's a foam put around this area here on the other side of this seat pan and uh, it keeps the draft from coming in and of course the heat or the cooling from the air conditioning going out. But over a period of time what happens is is this particular bit of foam starts to lose its resiliency. In other words it starts to collapse. So the bare shaft of this draft control starts to barely touch up here on that seat pan and when you move it it goes ee 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 and uh, I'm telling you like it was brutally annoying so the fix is either to split a piece of rubber hose and uh, put it over the shaft itself or you can take some wire loom like I'm showing you here about an inch of it slip it on over the uh, over the shaft just to keep the metal from metal separated and uh, that should solve your problem so I hope somebody out there has the issue and I hope this solves their problem so thanks for watching guys I hope it helps somebody take care and please subscribe